Actor Lee Jung Jae became the first Asian and Korean actor to win the Emmy Award for Best Actor on September 12th. On this day, Lee Jung Jae also appeared on stage as a presenter for the Outstanding Variety Sketch Series with actor Jung Ho Yeon. In his acceptance speech, Lee said, "I will share the joy with the people who are watching in Korea, my friends, family, and precious fans." For Lee Jung Jae, this is the fourth acting award trophy he won in the United States for the Netflix series Squid Game. Previously, Lee won the Actors Guild Award, Spirit Awards, and Critics Choice Award for Best Actor. After starting out as a model, Lee Jung Jae made his acting debut in the drama Dinosaur Teacher in 1993 and enjoyed his first heyday as a young star. He also rose to stardom with the hit drama Sandglass. At the age of 27, he won the Best Actor award at the Blue Dragon Film Festival for the movie City of the Rising Sun. He became a household name in his 30s and 40s, giving life to ever-changing characters. He took on various roles, transforming himself into a completely different person each time, and eventually earning the nickname Character Collector. Since then, Lee starred in the films like The Thieves, New World, The Face Reader, Assassination, and Along with the Gods, with four of his movies surpassing 10 million moviegoers. Since last year, he became a world star with Squid Game and reached a new career high. This year. Year is also a special year when Lee Jung Jae made his directorial debut with the spy movie Hunt, which he worked hard for four years, from writing to acting and directing. Recently, he was also cast as the main character in the Star Wars series The Acolyte, proudly rising to the ranks of global recognition. The Star Wars series is a popular culture content that has secured a huge number of fans all over the world. Thus, it is expected that Lee Jung Jae will actively advance into the United States movie industry.